Dr. Rosalyn S. Yalo, Nobel Laureate. Rosalind Yalo became the second woman and the first American-born and educated woman to win a Nobel Prize in physiology or medicine. The award was made in 1977 for the discovery of radioimmunoassay, RIA, a technique that allows scientists to measure minute amounts of many different substances in the blood by tagging them with radioactive tracers. RIA's ability to measure tiny amounts of substances have made more difference in medical research than any technique since the X-ray. This method is used in thousands of laboratories around the world to measure hundreds of substances of biologic interest in blood and other body fluids. RIA today is used to measure hormones, vitamins, enzymes, toxins, and other substances that prior to this invention were too small for physicians to detect. She has been the recipient of 54 honorary doctorates from universities in the United States and abroad. About the paucity of women in science, Ms. Yalo has stated, quote, the world cannot afford the loss of the talents of half its people if we are to solve the many problems which beset us." Unquote. We are proud to induct Dr. Rosalind S. Yalo, Nobel Laureate, to the Witte Hall of Fame for her outstanding contributions to the advancement of science and technology. Dr. Jala Dai accepts the award on behalf of Rosalind Yalo. Thank you, Linda. It is an absolute magnificent honor to stand here and accept the award on Dr. Yala's be behalf. Uh, just before coming to California, I did call her to see if she wanted to send a specific or a special message. She does send her regards. She is in good spirit, although her health condition is not as good as we all wish it to be. She's happily home, and her son is actually staying with her, and, and so she's in very good hands. Uh, it's, it, this is even a bigger thrill for me tonight to accept this award on her behalf than what I did when I received it last year myself, because it is women like Rosalind Yellow who are larger than life, and, and I feel very, very humble to be here to receive this award on her behalf. I do have very special feelings for Dr. Yellow, not because I did the kind of research she did, but what I did when I was a postdoc, I, I, I was dealing with a very difficult problem, technically speaking, and it was the technology that she, has, she had developed many years ago before I was a postdoc, that basically enabled me to publish some of the most beautiful papers that I think I had published. So I really used her technology to advance my research career. So I'm delighted to accept this uh, award on her behalf. And again, I'm, uh, I'm very pleased to share with you her greetings tonight. Thank you. <laughs> 